ministry is to get us closer to God through the Bible, practical living, and personal experiences. If you are to walk barefoot, there is a possibility for your feet to get hurt. So, to protect yourself, it will be best for you to wear shoes. Guess what? As we get closer to God, the enemy will seek to hurt us. Therefore, we gotta be protected by the Word of God. This ministry will show you different ways in which you can practically do that. Only by His grace. Oh yeah. <laughs> but how are you gonna be able to do that? There is gonna be different things that this ministry is gonna bring to you. What are we doing? Now it's time to get up get to meditate on God's nature, open our hearts to the Word of God, and to make His book our daily bread. One step closer, time for the Word. Here, we're actually going to take a look at the Word of God and see what He has to tell us according to the different experiences that we go through. And also, we'll be learning things like Prophecy, you all should know because through prophecy, God shows us His love. God shows us that He cares so much for us that He let us know the different things that are going to happen before He comes. Jesus is coming soon. It's good to know what things are coming up so we can also get ready for that. Um, Rich, <laughs> just pray for us. I'm also going to be blogging different things and, and so you can see more of a lifestyle of a Christian, you know, when we have many different activities or how it is out there for a Christian when you believe differently than your friends or anybody. So through the blogs, I'll be able to show you different ways also of what to do on um, dealing with some people that might not believe like you. Did you know that we are living in the last days? Captured this twister admits he was caught off guard and overnight exploded from 28 square miles to nearly 300 square miles. And that's not the only extreme weather we're seeing this weekend. Food shortages, high levels of insecurity, inflation, censorship, violation of human rights. It's time to wake up and hold on to God's word. One step closer, end time crisis. You know, in this world, there's so many things going on, and some of us are not even aware of them. Through this time, we're going to be able to take a look at the Word of God and see where we are at in Bible prophecy. Or not just that, it's just going to be different events that are going on in this world that allows us to see the things that are happening before Jesus comes. I think it's very important for us Christians to really know what's going on out there because there is a reason why God tells us what will happen, what will be coming up. And, and I think it's good to look at it in such a way that we can be awakened. It's not just about, oh, that's what's going on. But no, God uses that to awaken His people so that we can realize where we are at, what we're doing with our lives. And that way we have a chance to still change that and get closer to Him. Did you know that our body is the temple of God? And our mission is to take care of it. Hey, it's me, your sis, girling. One step closer, healthy life. I love eating, don't you? <laughs> and it's always good to eat healthy. Through this time, we'll be looking at different recipes that I probably made up while I was really hungry and just had to put things in or recipes that I really like that I would like to share with you. I am from Peru so I'll be definitely showing you different Peruvian recipes that are vegan. Go vegan! Oh yeah! And also 
we'll be looking at different ways to work out. It's not just about food and what we're eating, but we also have to get our body going. So, I'll be showing you also 8 secrets for a better lifestyle, for a better and healthier life. It's alright, I'm by your side and I'll take good care of you. Over here, we'll be doing different things like showing how to do some hairstyles, some natural makeup recipes that we could use to make our skin more smooth and pretty. The different ways in which we can naturally show how God created us. How does a Christian life look like? Hey, it's me, your sis, girling. One step closer, Christian life. I really want to just show you the insights of struggles, the reality of a Christian, the reality of a follower of God. I'm not perfect, and we're all striving to get to know Him more. We are all striving to be more like His image, to be more like God. And so, as I'm in my journey as well, you can come along and we can both get one step closer to God. And remember, we are all one family in Christ. Therefore, I'm your sister, and you're my brother or my sister. So I am very excited that you checked out this video and this channel, and I invite you that to walk with me and by subscribing to it and by telling others about it too. I really just want this ministry to be glorifying to God and I want God to guide me through this journey of my walk with Him and as I walk this walk with you as well. Even though the enemy might really get on our way, he cannot do nothing to us because we have to wear God's armor. He had put his armor in his word so we can be defended by it. God loves you. The struggles of life are real, people. It's time to wake up and get to know God more.